Hey guys, Coach Logan here again. Uh, I wanted to take another swing at Puzzle Rush, so uh, let's give it a shot. All right. All right, I can see already this one's going to be dropping the rook down. Okay. This one's knight takes d6. This one is taking the queen. This one is knight g2, it's mate. This one is queen h8. This one, um, let's go knight takes, then we have the rook hanging. Okay, we'll take the pawn and take the queen. Let's take the knight and take the bishop. Okay, we have king d1, it's not a big deal. All right, let's go queen takes d8, knight takes f7. This is mate. Okay, uh, the bishop takes h2, take the queen. Okay, let's go knight f6 and we take the queen. Okay, let's uh, take the knight and take the rook. Okay, let's go... Hmm. Uh, knight takes h3, is that cutting it? Uh, pawn takes, queen takes, yeah, I think that works. And, oh, oops, messed that one up. Okay, well this one is rook c8, and then we take the knight. Okay, this one, queen h8, should be mate. This one, uh, I think we can take and we have a Zvishenzug. Yeah, okay. This one, um, let's go... Take the queen. Um, this one, I think we can push the pawn. And we push the pawn and we're defending our rook, so that should do it. Um, this one, okay, we take the knight and the queen is hanging. That's 19. Okay, this one, um, let's take, I think, f5 check and then g6 should do it. This one, um, okay, if we drop the rook, oh no, let's uh, actually drop the queen in first, then. Uh, we've got some back rank. Okay, this one, um, well, I think we should take, and then we can take uh, over here. This one, um, okay, we can take with check, and then we have a runaway pawn. Okay, this one, um, let's see, okay, we can take the knight, and then this forks. Okay, this one, um, okay, this is uh, basically a Damiano's pattern. Uh, queen to h4, 5, and we got mate. Okay, this one feels very Greek gift like check. Queen h5. Yeah, that should do it. Queen h5 and f7 is hanging. That should do it. Okay, this one we've got check, check, and then the rook comes into g4. This one, um, hmm. Uh, okay, what's going on here? We've got, okay, I think we can get away with uh, taking that rook. And now, uh, Okay, they're trying to get rook a8 in. Um, just wondering if we have... Uh, okay, I feel like this check should be working. Yeah, okay, and then we take on a3. Okay, this one. Um, hmm. uh, okay, well, they're hanging on h7, and then we gotta make sure they're in a kill zone, and then this is mate. Okay, this one feels like we're gonna mate them on the h file, uh, but we need to be careful, because... Okay, uh, let's go rook h4. All right, I thought I had mate there. Maybe pawn to e4 cuts off the king, or sorry, cuts off the queen, good. Okay, this one, do we have a back rank somewhere? Looks very back ranky. Uh, let's go queen d8 and then rook to d8. This one, um, queen a8 check. They can play queen f8 uh, or bishop f8. Um, hmm. uh, let's see. Um, hmm. Oh, actually, I think what I can do here is go take, check, and then, okay, then the knight's hanging. All right, I was going to attack the pin knight before. All right, so now this one, where's the board going? Okay, we're going this way. We want to push and promote, but they're threatening our rook, but that's okay. We can take, and then, um, oh, actually, no, I was going to do that. No, we stopped them from queening, and they're outside the square. Okay, this one, um... Well, I think queen takes b5 looks pretty good. Uh, oh, no, then it's just even in material. So maybe knight takes b5 will flush their king out. Yeah, let's try knight takes. They take the knight, then I have knight c7. That should be just winning. Uh, yeah, that should do the trick. Okay, we're at 34. Um, this one, uh, okay, um, let's go knight f3 should do it. And then queen to d3 looks pretty decisive. Queen, uh, no, knight takes, and that's winning. Okay, 35. Uh, this one, let's start with check. 
Um, let's go. Uh, hmm. Uh, let's go check, and then we take the rook. Okay, this one. Um, all right, what's going on here? All right, I think I'm just going to guess because it's uh, coming up on time. Uh, do we take that? No. Okay. All right. Well, 36. Uh, so that's a is that a new score for me? All right. Um, it's not the highest I've ever gotten on, on chess.com ever on any account I've ever had. I've had 38 before. I would like to hit 40. Um, I'm, I'm working on my puzzle rush more, but this is not bad. In the last hour, that was number five behind, uh, well, behind Josh Friedel, who's a grandmaster, uh, and I am, and then two other GMs, uh, or no, that one of them was a candidate master, but still in pretty good company. Okay, um, well, I'll keep at it. I want to break, I want to hit 40 on this, um, and then I want to hit 50, and, uh, you know, and beyond. All right, I'll submit that. Oh, wh which, what was the answer to that last one? I was wondering about that. Um, okay, so let's take a look now that I'm not on the clock. Um, wait, is my queen not being attacked? Okay, when I was low on time, I thought my queen was being attacked. So if it's not being attacked, I think I can go knight takes d2, queen takes d2, uh, bishop takes c3. No, sorry, uh, just knight e4, right? So let's, uh, here, I'm going to try this again, play the problem. So I think this is the answer. I think, oh, no, my queen is being attacked. Okay, I'm not crazy. Um, so, all right, well then, um, I think I want knight takes d2, because I'd be threatening knight f3, and now here, I, does knight e4 work? Um, no, but I think bishop takes c3 works now, because I'm attacking the queen, and if they take me, then they're going to have a hanging rook at some point, yeah. Okay, so that's the answer to that one, um, and then if I go back, ah, okay, well, let me see the other one. All right, uh, so that was a good one. I'll see you guys next video.